I'm gonna react to the How It Should Have Ended version of Dark Fate. First, quick shout out to Demon Size Synthwave. He sent me this link. Then John Bamford sent it to me, but it was like five minutes apart. But I would have done it anyway, maybe. All right, here we go. Okay, there's a parachute in the back. We can tangle him up. Wait for him to attack, and then we move. Okay. <gasps> Don't let her die for me again. Then you need to be ready. Adios mio! Sarah, you gotta come back with me! What the heck? It's your kid, Sarah! Something has gotta be done about your kid! Are you telling me that all I have to do is wait until time travel exists and I can rescue my son? Precisely, Sarah! Except instead of waiting years and years for you to make that journey, I decided just to come to you! I know a thing or two about course correction in the future. Nice. Uh, what the heck just happened? You see, Sarah, your son's death caused a new timeline of copycat Terminators. Without you being there to guide John and pass on your wisdom, millions of humans were cheated out of a leader they so desperately waited years to have. By giving up on your boy <laughs> and forcing the new girl to take his place, it caused a colossal collapse of faith in the franchise. I mean, the timeline. Really? I thought they'd just move on and not really notice. They never move on, Sarah. You mean too much to them. You're more than just a womb. Now, quick, we have to hurry. <laughs> Where are we anyway? I know where we are. Goodbye. Wait, stop! You don't have to melt him! Who are you? He looks just like you, but old and flabby. It's another Terminator! Kill it, Mom! No, I'm just you from the future. But there is actually another Terminator out there, just like him. He's still looking for you. And he kills John right after this scene, so don't melt that one. Oh my gosh, this is exhausting. Yeah, it is. But the good news is the T-800s can all become nice now. Yeah, the one that kills you moves in with some weird lady in the woods and becomes her nanny or something. Sounds kind of lame. Trust me, it's better than other ways this story could have gone. Okay then, what do we do? We terminate the Terminator. <laughs> Your arm, your face, and your CPU chip smashed to pieces. <laughs> Hasta la vista, Carl. <laughs> Easy money. feels kind of done so maybe don't do anything more from this point yeah you should probably just stop now thank you okay i am back oh <laughs> all right all right, that was kind of interesting. I usually try to sit here like, you know, little exaggeration, little smile, a little more than normal because it's too boring if I do a reaction like this because I don't react so well, but I was actually laughing at that. And yeah, I'll, I'll be really honest, guys. You know, I'm not the greatest at reactions. I'm not the greatest at commentary and speaking clearly because I speak two languages. I'm from New York and I don't speak clearly in the first place, but we'll get through it. Anyway. You guys let me know what you think about that down below. By the way, Dark Fate sucks. I hate it. So it was kind of cool seeing John Connor live and just, yeah, it was just a cartoon, just a little thing. But even that, like the lines like, oh, you're more than a womb. You know, the complaints that Sarah Connor was just the woman to give birth to John. Come on. Give me a break with that crap. Dark Fate sucks. I'll say it again. And if you don't think Dark Fate sucks, that's okay. But I do. Anyway. Doing shoutouts, special thanks, things like that. Click that subscribe button if you haven't. Especially click that subscribe button if you don't like Dark Fate. See you next time.